Hey everybody, welcome to My Well TV. I'm Charles Conley, I'm gonna be your host today. Today's episode is all about Partida Tequila. We have a couple great things in store for you. An interview with the master distiller, Jose Valdez from Partida. Also some quick and simple recipes using fresh local ingredients and Partida Tequila for a great cocktail you can make at home. Salud. Hey folks, got some fun and fresh cocktail ideas here using Partida Tequila. Um, and just some local berries I picked up at the farmer's market here in uh, downtown Sacramento. Uh, we're making la cosecha, it means the harvest. Uh, today I'm using blackberries and strawberries. You can use whatever fruit you like, um, but let's go, let's do it. I'm gonna add a few fresh blackberries that I've pre-washed and cut here, strawberries. I'm gonna take a muddle to it, release all those flavors so they can mix up real nice with our tequila. That done here. I'm gonna use an ounce and a half of Partida Blanco. Really nice for mixing, really makes some really awesome cocktails. I'm gonna add that into our fresh berries. Now here, instead of using sugar, I'm gonna use some fresh agave nectar, a natural sweetener. Uh, you can find this at any local grocery store, um, maybe Whole Foods or even your local farmer's market might have some. I'm gonna add a little ice here. I'm gonna give it a nice little shake. Make sure you shake it up. Nice and good, mix all those ingredients together. See that nice dark rich color you get from the berries? You're gonna impress all your friends. After we've shaken it, we're gonna strain it into our, our champagne glass here. And we're gonna to top it off with just a little champagne. Anything will really do, you don't need to get too fancy. Garnish with a fresh berry or edible flower, whatever you'd like to do that with. Now we're done here, we're gonna share this with one of our customers here, Terry. Give that a try, let me know what you think. It's awesome! Good, good, I'm happy you like it, cheers! Cheers! Hey folks, we're here with uh, Jose Valdez of Partida Tequila. Welcome to my well. Thank you, Charles. Do we think that tequila has any medicinal purposes? Do you know anything about that? Uh, or? To be honest, I don't know, but uh, I know that the, you know, the whiskey is depressive spirit and tequila is uh, encourage the body and to feel better. It, tequila is a stimulant. It's a stimulant. Yeah. yeah. Awesome, awesome. I think we all, we've all seen a, a Partida commercial a web video we want to know, what is shitty tequila face? <laughs> oh, shitty tequila. Okay, the best way to describe shitty tequila face is... So that, that is about the best way to explain shitty tequila face. Partida Tequila is a pretty new brand. Uh, we, the brand was launched in 2005, eight years ago. And uh, I was with Partida since the beginning of the project. Great. Uh, my before Partida used to. I'm an engineer, so I used to work for a, a electronic manufacturing company in Guadalajara. You know, okay. Guadalajara is a Silicon Valley, yeah, if, of Mexico. So many manufacturing there. This is a little more fun making tequila, huh? Correct, <laughs> correct. It wasn't a hard, a hard, a hard decision. You know, for for our new viewers out there, or people who maybe aren't as informed about tequila. So maybe a quick process on, uh, on how tequila is made, or what it's made from, you know. Yeah, tequila, it's, uh, there are two big di divisions in tequila. One is 100% uh, tequila, and the other one is just tequila. 100% tequila use only 100% agave, sugar that comes from agave, and the other tequila is uh, a minimum of 51% agave, and the other 49 from other uh, type of sugar. So Partida carries only 100% tequila. And the only difference between Blanco, Reposado, and Añejo, and Extrañejo, which are the four types that we have, is the time of aging in the barrel. Okay, so the longer you age it, you know, you're gonna go make a Reposado, and then age longer becomes Añejo. Correct. Up to extra Añejo. Correct, and Partida is above the minimum. The minimum that the Mexican law said, it's Reposado it's two months, Añejo a year, so Partida is six months, a year and a half. So okay, and then what about the Elegante here? How Elegante long? is a minimum of three years, so 36 months. In Partida, it's 40 months. 40 months, okay. Yeah. Great, great, so about three and a half years. Yes. Awesome, and that's where we're getting the, the richer color from. Correct. Great, great. 
Jose, thank you so much for joining us here at MyWell and on MyWell TV. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook and Twitter. Thank you very much. Appreciate you watching. Hey, where are you going? Thanks for watching our video. New videos are coming all the time, so don't forget to subscribe. Oh, and check out some of our other videos like this one. And this one. Also, we'd love to hear from you on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, so don't forget to send us a shout. Thanks for watching.